Yeah, track conditions were a little bit trickier today. It was uh, definitely windy at the top. It was blowing like whole side winds and stuff, and then a few holes in the, in the wrong spots, like coming into a couple of those rock guards, which is like big front wheel holes. So definitely had to stiffen up my bike a touch for today. And, uh, yeah, just keep looking forward and uh, get it done. So definitely feels good to get another win. Uh, I wanted to keep my sleeve for a little longer. So yeah, happy with how the day went and uh, yeah, represent America. You know, I, I I've had a lot of nerves coming into this weekend. I wasn't really thinking about it. I had some people telling me, hey, you know, you're gonna do it. You're gonna come away with two jerseys, and I was like, eh, you know, that would be that's a pipe dream. You know, um, yesterday was a huge confidence builder. I couldn't have, it was so great to have that short short track yesterday. Um, yeah, I knew I could do it. Uh, it was just about her hanging with Erin. She had this like killer attack on the last, the steepest pitch on the last lap. And I knew if I could hang with her, I could get around her at the top and that's how it played out. Uh, it's special, man. A national champ has always been kind of a spe special race for me. I've been fortunate to win it uh, quite a few times and uh, always a race I look forward to every year and one that I definitely want to do well at. So really stoked to uh, keep the, the Stars and Stripes sleeve for another year and uh, take it back to the World Cups. Yeah, every lap I would get gapped out a little bit on the descent and usually be able to bridge back up by the top of the climb. And then on the, I guess, second to last lap, I gave it a go because I saw Keegan was coming up to us. And so I had the opportunity to get as much time on the climb. And then that was enough of a buffer, buffer on the last two descents that I had to do to roll in for the win.